your girl Andrea Michelle sis and yes we're back and guess what guess what I don't know if you know but Dollar Tree is stepping their game up like they got some good products up in there so I went to Dollar Tree the other day um, I was going to put that video out but I want to go ahead and show you guys my um, day in the life of a mom of one and I put that out I hope you guys enjoyed it um, and um, I decided to go ahead and put out this Dollar Tree haul now I only went to the Dollar Tree yes sis yes sissy I went to the Dollar Tree only for some white plates and white bows and some wine glasses because I want to switch up my color theme in my cabinet um, as far as when I have guests over at my house but they were I don't know what kind of place those was I mean if you're into the whole like uh, rose gold trim plates or the silver trim gold plates if you saw that at your local Dollar Tree um, they were kind of cute but I was just looking for a normal white plate um, and I normally have like um, bigger bowls like I'm looking for a water bowl and a square white plate but I think I'm gonna have to order it on Amazon because I I went there like three times to Dollar Tree and they didn't have it. But anyways, you guys, welcome back, and I know you're all ready to see what I found at the Dollar Tree. Um, um, I found some good things, you guys. But anyways, make sure you go ahead and subscribe and like this video and um, turn on all post notifications because that is something you need especially when I'm uploading cleaning videos and cooking videos and um, these hauls um, I don't want you to miss any of that but anyways I don't want to ramble I don't want to hold y'all long so yeah let's get right into it but first let me make me some tea because um, it's this text is honey for me okay now I don't have the tea the tea tea but I do have the tea that we drink <laughs> So let me go ahead and put that in there. I just put a little bit. I can drink my tea without honey, but um, I just honestly love honey in my tea. And I love this cup, you guys. I bought this at, I think when I was in, and uh, I want to say Galveston, or on the way to Galveston, I bought um this cup at one of the little local service stations um, I think Bucky Bucky's you guys I'm going through something I don't know my mom said it was salt intake my hands swollen I can't like I can't do anything with it it hurts so bad you guys um, but I've been trying to use it and it just hurts so 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 freaking bad I don't want to sound like a crybaby but it does it hurts so bad so I'm gonna switch hands and try to hold my camera with my other finger and then just try to pour this in there which I know I can do and if you're wondering oops I want to get all that tea uh, but if you're wondering what kind of tea I am drinking I'm drinking one of the you know little tea bag things here hopefully it doesn't fall into it so I can show you guys um it's the Tivana tea and it's green tea. I do have the citrus pink tea, but this is jade citrus mint um, flavored green tea with spearmint and lemongrass. The caffeine level it says basically what was it two? So it's uh, brewing methods, a standard eight four ounce um, drip. So I mm, but these are the teas and these are Starbucks teas so these are the teas that you see that they make like ice the ice teas and stuff like that or the regular teas so yeah I got that I think this is like three dollars so I got two of these I got one peach and one green um, the peach tea I like to brew in the pot as well as the I just I don't know I like my um, curry but um, I like to do it the old fashioned way like my mama do it. It's more better. Um, so I just started getting used to doing it that way. 
um, especially with teas, but my coffee, I use my Kiri. Um, but it just tastes more, I don't know, it tastes more fresher that way when it's in the pot. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I got that. So let's go ahead and get into our Dollar Tree um, haul. Okay, I want to start with the food first. Now, I see my CC cat haul some of this stuff, and I was like, determined to go to my Dollar Tree and find it and guess what I found some of the stuff that she be hauling and she's another youtuber um youtuber mom on YouTube um it's Sam and Kat I know I mention her a lot of times but me and her just click 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 clickety clack that's my sissy um and she from uh South Carolina and her family is so beautiful I just I love her all the way around um it's just like she's my big sister okay um so anyways um she had these nuggets in her haul on her dollar she hauls and I honestly look you guys I don't know how to like coupon and dollar general and stuff like that um and um what is it dollar general yeah dollar general and yesterday she put up a a, a, a coupon um, haul and if you guys want to check that out go ahead and go to her channel Sam and Cat S A M M and not A N D but and <laughs> um Cat K A T T um and she put up she's putting up like coupon stuff that she used a coupon in um Dollar Journal and stuff like that. Now I told her that I'm not a I'm not a pro when it comes to Dollar Journal because Look, but I did go ahead and download the app. I did clip some coupons, and what I'm going to do is just write everything out, go to Dollar Tree, find it, and then um, use my um, what is it called? Digital coupon. That's what she uses, digital coupon. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try that out, y'all. So, uh, stay tuned for that because look, I want to save too. Okay, like. I, I fell so much in Dollar General. It's crazy. It is crazy. Um, but anyways, these are the chicken tenders that she, the chicken tender strips that she uh, found in one of her hauls. So I went to my Dollar Tree and they had it, which I'm really excited. She said they taste good, um, and I'm sure that they do. Um, so these are fully cooked chicken strips, um, breaded strips, um, shaped chicken breasts. Um, so those are what it looks like. I'll bring it closer so you guys can see. Um, and if you guys have these in your Dollar Tree, let me know. Um, and have you tried them as well? Um, and then for my Dollar Tree, like this is like a new product for us because I've never seen this in the Dollar Tree, um, in our Dollar Tree before. So this is really new and they were stocking like crazy uh, the day I went in there. So I was really excited. Also, they had like, I wonder if... Um, they had like these muffins. I don't know if they was cornerstone muffins. Um, I think it's like a cornerstone bakery muffin, a bakery that they have. But they had some muffins, but they were in the freezing section, so I didn't get them because I didn't know if you could like what you're supposed to do with them, like put them in the oven or in microwave. Um, but they were like back in the back, and my mom always taught us like if some back in the back, don't get back in the back. Okay, honey. <laughs> She said, don't ever get first, the first product either. Maybe get the, the third and fourth product, but don't get the first and second product. Because normally the stuff is kind of old. So, like I was digging around and this lady was looking at me and I was like, well, that's what my mama told me. Uh, <laughs> but anyways, um, I got these fully cooked chicken nuggets. They're breaded as well. I can't wait to fry those up or put them in the oven. And then I found these Finger Food Factory Tater Rounds. Um, seasoned shredded potato um, so when I said when I th thought about it and I was thinking about it and then I had got on here and I was talking to you guys and it says t uh, tater rounds don't they supposed to be like round rounds I don't know but um, they said they're extra crispy um, and this is what they call tater rounds but I know in the store they do have tater tot rounds you guys um, so yeah they had those um, and then also I had a coupon for these as well and they finally got them there and there were only three left so I know that they probably won't have any of them um, on the next go but I will take my coupon because they're a like dollar off and that which making them free at Dollar Tree I mean I know it's Dollar Tree but still you can save you some coins sis 
uh, are my brothers. And then, so I did find this season blend mix. Um, the other season blend mix that they had, I did not like it. Like you guys, I did not like it. But this one looks more fresher. Um, I don't know if it's in a newer bag or what. But it has onion, celery, red and green bell peppers, and parsley. And I normally try to make this myself homemade. I'll just buy two yellow onions and the bell peppers. And I don't really like celery, but if it's already in there, then I'll just leave it. It is what it is, but it's really good in uh, different dishes. And then also, um, I found the Mrs. Phil's um, chocolate chip. Um, six bit cookie doughs so I can't wait to try these out as well honestly I don't know what happened to Mrs. Fields because we used to like a long time ago like when we was like little coming up um, I think my mom had took us there one time and then when I started growing up I went there a couple of times it was in the um, it was in the underground um, here in Dallas we have like an underground shopping area that we can go to um, and so it's called underground tunnels so you can go and shop they have like perfect perfume um, sections where you can buy perfume you can buy clothes it's just like a little you know uh, um, a little shopping thing you can go to but they have like mostly food down there and so um, yeah they used to have a Mrs. Fields but when I went there a long time ago <laughs> Mrs. Fields was closed so that was really sad so I'm glad they're still bringing out their um, cookie dough and stuff like that but that is the end of the food haul let me get the other stuff straightened out and then we can go definitely into that okay so um, I did get some of this um, 1000 milligram of vitamin C um, orange peach, peach orange peach mango um, from Sunkiss um i bought this just for me and my son when we go out to walk and stuff this is my son's jug and these are bpa free um this is his jug he's eight years old so um there's no need to have like a, a baby jug anymore so i got him one of those um and then i got myself this one i honestly you guys love teal i love pink <laughs> um but i got this one as well and I thought about we can do like a little project on these. He can decorate his with stickers, I guess. Whatever kind of stickers. He's into Thomas Train and Roblox and Minecraft. Um, so uh, I'm going to try to find him some, some peel and stick stickers for that. So he can peel it and stick it. And we can also take the stickers off as well. And then I was going to think about making something really cute for mines. But me personally, I just... I'm normal, simple, normal. <laughs> um, so I'll probably just keep it like that. But yeah, we um, I saw this and I was like, well, let me grab some of this um, and try it. So whenever we go out to um, the park or whatever, we can have our vitamin C for our immune systems. Okay, and so for like um, cabinet stuff and cleaning stuff, I bought um, this 25% more Sure Scent Lemon. Um, air freshener I use this like in the bathroom um, and honestly this is my first time buying it now they have some lemon sure scent I don't know how to explain it it's like the little beads that they have at Dollar Tree I bought some I bought some of those and keep them in the bathroom because they last a long time so I wanted to go ahead and buy some of the spray um, these are good when, when it's closed in like if you spray it in a closed in room it's awesome it works very well but if you use it like in an open area it's like you can smell it but the scent like it just va it just like vanished <laughs> you know what I mean um so it's just like you hadn't sprayed it um but it doesn't last longer in an open room as much as it lasts in a closed room so that's why I bought that for the bathroom and then this right here I've never seen at Dollar Tree is called Wizard the Magic of Fresh and it's called Morning Mist Odor Neutralizer and Air Freshener and I was reading the back and I didn't I was trying to honestly see where it came from but it says that it was made in Turkey so this may be a turkey air fry or air fryer air freshener um, from Turkey um, so 
that's really cool um, to have something from Turkey. I ain't never been to Turkey before, but <laughs> yeah. Um, and if you guys didn't know, like I am a huge fan of like British and London um, cleaning products as well. I do have a couple of products uh, at my house that is from Britain, um, especially their cleaning products. I feel like their cleaning products is so much better than uh, the United States cleaning products um, because I bought like some sprays and I bought like some soaps and stuff like that and I mean it works so amazing the suds of their uh, dishwashing soap is it's crazy you guys so if you ever get a chance to either go to Britain or London or um, Australia then pick up some of their cleaning supplies because their cleaning supplies are amazing or you can order it online I think um, I used to order from the Britain store, but they, they shipping had got like really, really expensive. And I think this is when people didn't really know about it, um, that you can buy a product for them. And once people started finding out about them, then their shipping started going up. So I had, um, bought a couple of things and my shipping would have been a hundred bucks. You guys like seriously, a hundred bucks for two or three things. And I was just like, nope. <laughs> But anyways, I found these microfiber cleaning towels, two to a pack, and this is uh, the brand Scrub It. So I got two of those, which is making four towels, and they feel really, really soft, you guys. So I'm going to, um, most of the time, I'm using my, um, I don't have dish towels in my house. Um, I only have drying towels and um, other stove decorating towels, <laughs> and I use those for drying and cleaning my like my pots and pans and stuff like that so now I'm just gonna use like two for my pots and pans and then just two for cleaning just depends on how um, if I don't go to like Burlington or uh, Ross to buy um, dish towels but um, yeah and then I got this aluminum foil sheets you guys I want to make this clear like you guys the other little foil, what is it called? Reynolds. It's a good product. And Dollar Tree does have Reynolds um, little foil there. But if you look at the square footage of the little foil, it's not as much as Dollar Tree uh, little foil is. So I got the little foil foil sheets. And Reynolds have the same thing. But Dollar Tree is, um, they have 20% 20, 20 more uh, sheets versus the leading brand. So they have 30 sheets in here and I think Reynolds had like 15, I think 15 or 20 sheets. But I mean, they're all the same thing. The Lunafuls are the same thing. So I got wound up getting two of these, which making it 60 sheets. Um, so I got two of those. I was going to get my mom some, but she is stuck on her Reynolds. <laughs> but um, I don't have a problem with it. Um, and then also for dishwashing, I like to get this. I got the one at home. It's called... Uh, rose something it smells so so good when I tell you that this product it suds up it suds up now I never seen this one in Dollar Tree this was the first time I saw this so I went ahead and picked it up honestly I didn't like it when I picked it up I had to open a ziploc bag in Dollar Tree and put the this over it and I told the man I'm not like literally I'm not gonna touch that because like all of them were like they were busted up and stuff was coming out of it and I'm not sure where they were delivered from but they were messed up and so um, he said it was fine whatever he's gonna put the Ziploc bag thing on clearance I said wait hold on wait a minute if you're gonna put it on clearance then how much he said 50 cents so I wound up getting the Ziploc bags for 50 cents but um, I don't even think he charged me for this because it was just so nasty with uh, this product like this was filled to the T and by the time like when I start picking it up and it started oozing all out it just went down so and it wasn't just this only one it was a couple of more uh, of them because I was looking for them to see if I can get a cleaner one and I don't know what was going on with that shipment but um, when I got home I hurry up and washed it with hot water but um, when I once I was washing it um, it was like the, the bubbles the suds and stuff like that the bubbles um, I mean, it, it worked like it smells really good, and this is the uh, the totally awesome ultra concentrated dish liquid uh, detergent, and it's the oxy blue. So it's kind of compared to your normal done um, oxy 
but theirs is really really good so if you find this in your local dollar tree definitely pick that up and i'm going to put this back on top just in case but i know i cleaned it well so i know it's not going to do anything but just in case um uh, and you guys review on this tissue you see i bought some more um the oh so soft oh my goodness when it says oh so soft yes oh so soft to the tush um it works really well so if you have these in your dollar tree they are leaving my dollar tree I, like these are the last two so i got um how many i got two four six seven eight i got nine of these um already um, but they are compared basically to, um, it doesn't say, but they're compared to like the leading brand, uh, Charmin tissue or what was it? It was another tissue. I can't remember, but they're compared to that. And these are, these are really, really soft to the butt. Like seriously, um, they're soft to the bone. And if you have these, you guys definitely grab them. They're 400 sheets per roll. Um, and when I tell you like their mom approved my son approved like they're good so they're called oh so soft <laughs> uh, and you can find these at Dollar Tree for one dollar so that's it for um, just the all the way around cleaning and for our, you know walking we go walking our drinks and stuff like that now let's get into like the personal hygiene stuff so before I get to the personal hygiene stuff from Dollar Tree, I forgot um, I put this stuff inside of <laughs> the personal bag um, because the guy that uh, checked me out, he didn't pretty much put um, things in the right bag. I don't know if you guys are like that. I don't like when people throw stuff in the bag. Um, so I'll try to um, reorganize it once I get in the car. But I got this... Um, Pampa Instant Bouillon Cubes Chicken. Um, and I've never tried this, but I wanted to go ahead and give it a go and try it. I love chicken bouillon and I like vegetable bouillon and the veg the vegan um, bouillon as well too. But I want to go ahead and try this one. Looks like it'll be um, good on chicken um, or any like pasta, like any pasta dish that you make. Um, and then I got this, I don't know if it's Texas Longhorn Steak Grill Seasoning. Um, so I got went ahead and got this. And if you guys know, I'm from Texas. And we have a Texas Roll House uh, restaurant. And it's so freaking good. So I was thinking like, I don't know. Like this may, may compare to some of the seasonings that they use on their meats. I like to get their chicken fried chicken. That's the only thing I pretty much get there. Um, I really don't eat red meat like that. But if I'm in the mood to eat like a steak or something, like every once in a while, a full blue moon. <laughs> and that'd be uh, every full blue moon that there is. <laughs> um, I'll get a steak, a steak. And that seasoning on their steak is really, really good. So, um... Every full blue moon, I might use this, but I may use this on chicken because I think you can use this on, it says grill seasoning, so I think you, once I learn how to grill, I'm going to use this on like my chicken and stuff like that. So those are the two that uh, kind of slipped away from the uh, food, the, uh, the food haul. So those are the two that I forgot to show you guys. So let's get into the personal hygiene haul. So here we are with the last haul that I have um, from Dollar Tree. Um, so I picked up some of these Beak Sensitive Razors and they are uh, three flexible blades. Now I'm not going to lie you guys, I like to use sometimes, um, but since I got a shaver now, um, I'm one of those type of people I don't like hair under my arm or down below um so i wanted to get two of these for my underarms um but the shaver that i have now it does the job but just in case that be don't want to work for me one day i can go to these and so i'll put these in my little stockpile um but how nice was it to find these at dollar tree they don't have these often um so i got a pink one and i got a, a green one 
Um, so yeah, we have these at my Dollar Tree, and they're for sensitive skin, which I do have. Um, so I got these two. And then I did get some more of, and I have used this, and obviously it is really good. Um, this is the, um, the shaving cream, and this is in the flavor of pomegranate, or scent, pomegranate and raspberry. And this right here is really, really good. And when it says it's super smooth going on, like seriously, it's super smooth. Now, I haven't used this in a while. I either use this under my arms or um, if I get hair on top of my arms. But that hasn't happened because I, um, you know, have my electric shaver now. Um, I don't have hair on my legs, you guys. Ooh. My hand is really going out, you guys. It is hurting so bad. So let me hurry up and get through this before I drop the camera again. But, um, yeah, this is really good. And it says that it's compared to the Ecos Shaving Cream. But it's really good. And it's also animal cruelty free. Um, so, yeah, I love to use this. It makes, like, my shaving. If I'm shaving with a razor, it goes nice and smooth. Um, and I don't have to worry about, like getting um like shaving bumps or whatever um because this right here helps protect against that and then i also picked up some of these Ucotex. oh let me tell you guys i have coupons for these and i just didn't take them i could have got all this stuff for free like these two and that for free but um and that's not personal honey <laughs> but i got some you Kotex 16 um, wrap daily liners. These are the security light days uh, wrap liner, and these are the long ones. Um, and I'm not gonna lie to you guys because we're all females, and if I have brothers here, then if you got a female, um, this is just life. Uh, <laughs> especially when you're in your late 20s, in your early 30s, middle 30s, a girl, your body changes, okay, especially after your period, your body changes, so I use these after my period um, comes, um, or after it comes, um, just for the light drip of the period, um, the ending of the period, um, so that's why I get these, and I'm glad I got the long ones, because the short ones that I get uh, never works for me. <laughs> So, I always see these in Dollar Tree and never pick them up or never even stop to look. Because I always get the curve-free ones and the pink because that's the ones that I normally use. But, um, I'm glad that I noticed these and picked them up because I will start switching over to them. And they're only a dollar and there's 16 of them. Um, and the curve-free one, I think there's like 25, but that's okay. Um, because I only use these, honestly, after my period, um, for that extra bye-bye drip. <laughs> And so I found some more. Uh, oh, you guys, I don't know if it's on my lips still, but let me turn this camera around. So this is the lippy that I got from the Dollar Tree the other time. But I told you guys I would review it and show it to you guys. So this is the lippy that I got last time. It's like a mauve color. It's really pretty. Um, and then I got this one, which is probably a mauve color. But this one's called... This is LA Color Intense Color Lip Gloss. Um, and I really love their products. Um, but this is called Dancer Number CBLG893. Just in case you don't see that um, that name on it. But yeah, it says it's a lip, a lip color lip gloss. But yeah, I got that. And I do honestly love the LA colors. Now, I know y'all looking at them laxatives over there. Like, I'm not going to lie about it. Sometimes you get a little constipated. Mm-hmm. Yep. Especially when you eat cheese and you know you're not supposed to be eating cheese like me. Lactose intolerant. But I still do it. Uh, <laughs> um, and I really got to stop. And I got to really stop my... Even though that's supposed to be a good salt intake. The sea salt. My mom told me that it's still salt. So, it doesn't matter if it's sea salt or not. It's still salt. So... Um, I have to stop and I'm start buying Miss Dash Season Salt. Or I'll start going to Dollar Tree and see if they have any sea salt uh, products there. Or not sea salt, but salt free products uh, seasoning there. Um, but I got the Ins Assured Laxative. Um, and you already know laxatives, what they do. Um, it says gentle, um, dependable, <laughs> uh, constipation relief, comfort 
coating really it's honestly tastes like sugar coating I don't know but this is the actual size and that's what it really looks like it looks that little and there's 25 tablets now I've already I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like if it, yeah once they fall on the floor <laughs> uh, if I can I don't know if you guys can see it but that's what they look like pretty much they're little tiny so yeah, but um, reviewing this uh, because I already took them. At first, I was scared because a lot of Dollar Tree um, medications and stuff that you try sometimes they don't work. But um, by far, this is a good, good, good product. Um, so if you're in the laxative nature and you need to release something, okay, sis, go ahead and get yourself some. These are compared to the active ingredient in uh, uh what's it, Dolco. Dual, laxative so yeah the regular laxative but these works really well i don't suggest you take them every day um but take them whenever it's needed um like i said this is really not personal but personal for my candles <laughs> um i got the um uh the scripto uh, lighters i thought these were really pretty colors it's like a hot yellow and then a hot pink i only use these for my candles you guys so that's why I need some of these. Actually, honestly, I didn't need them. I just bought it for the color. <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> uh, so, <laughs> um, yeah, I bought them from the color. But most likely, they are going to be used. And they do recommend you to keep these out of the children's way. Okay? Keep them out of their eyesight. Put them in the top of the cabinet um, or in your room. Um uh, you know under your bed whatever I well I don't suggest you put them under your bed I'm sorry you guys but put them away somewhere safe where the kids won't get them <laughs> so yeah my son knows automatically not to play with a lighter um, so I don't really have to hide anything from him he is terrified of anything fireish um, so yeah you guys I'm gonna go ahead and drink my tea I'm probably going to film, I'm going to take my son to his school and we're going to um, play baseball. Um, now you won't see the school, but you'll see us um, playing baseball. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get him out the house today. I want to go to, we were supposed to go to this yogurt place yesterday, but we didn't get a chance to go. Um, so I want to go to this yogurt place, like probably a couple of minutes or maybe five or ten minutes away from the house. We can walk there. Um, so we'll probably walk, just walk there and get out in bonds. Fun with your kids. Fun, bun, bun. Um, my son had this thing where he is always on his tablet or his iPad. And girl, I got to, I got to get him off. But anyways, I'm turning off these lights. I'm turning off these lights, girl. But anyways, um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully that'll be like a cleaning video. Um, good update um at my house i wasn't there for a while because we didn't have hot water but we have hot water now so i am thanking god praising him that we have hot water um thank you if you pray for us that we get hot water because we didn't have it because of the snowstorm and it's been over what three weeks now since that happened and yeah we just been dealing been dealing been patient um, been positive energy and my mom's been here for us so I just thank her too I love her very much I love you guys so yes we'll see you in the next video bye